Hey guys, welcome back to Modern Golf. I hope you guys are doing great. Today we're talking about a little bit of follow-up um, from my review a few months ago of these Thursday boots. Um, and I just want to kind of do a quick follow-up because things have gone, uh, let's say sideways. We've made a U-turn, we've turned left, whatever you want it is. They're not what I thought they were. Um, so just want to kind of go over real quick. I don't want to throw shade at people. I just want to kind of keep it real. I, I always feel like that's kind of part of what I do and uh, what we're doing here is just kind of want to give you an update of really what the experience has been with these guys. So I bought the same version of this with a wedge sole a few years ago. Did a review uh, last year on those guys. And I probably wore those boots, let's say 500 times, literally. Um, and they held up incredibly well. They wore like iron, just phenomenal boots. Fast forward to the Scout, um, this version, which is a little different sole um, and what have you. And these have been kind of the complete opposite of the original pair. And what I mean by that, the first pair broke in really well um, they were super comfortable to wear. Again, 500, I'm not kidding, 500 wears. I wore them almost every day to work uh, during COVID and uh, just wore them all the time. And these guys were very difficult to break in. Um, I contacted, they were so difficult to, to break in, I contacted Thursday Boots. And this is where the story kind of takes a left turn. Um, I said, hey, these are very difficult to break in. I don't know if it's, are you change your construction? What exactly is going on? And it's a third party that handles this for them. Uh, like a lot of companies that, I, that we've all worked with, um, it's a third party that handles the customer service part of this. Um, and I went back and forth and they said, can you send me pictures? And I was showing the pictures and I said, it's, it's very stiff um, and I think I, Told you guys before, and I'll take the shoe tree out here. Um, they're very, they're still really stiff, like really stiff. Um, and I don't know if they're Goodyear welted. I, I don't know if they're cemented or whatever process that this particular pair or this series um, of shoes is is done. It's produced or manufactured. Uh, but anyway, so I went back and forth, and the lady said, "Can you send me pictures?" And I said, "How do I send you pictures of shoes not breaking in?" comfortably like not not comfortably but like literally like they're so stiff i can't even bend them um and i also said by the way um the soles wearing out super quick and i'll try to show you guys pictures and i don't know if you can pick it up on the camera here but literally the sole is worn out already in the ball of my foot where i'm walking and also in the heel um and so their conversation back to me and their comments back to me were um, sir, I think you're using, you're wearing the boots incorrectly. And I said, I'm sorry, what? And they said, yeah, are you dragging your feet? Are you? And I said, okay, let's back up. Let's say I was dragging my feet, um, and I'm not, but let's say they are. It has nothing to do with breaking them in. The fact that this gum sole is wearing out so quick is probably because these are $160 boots. They're not exactly ideal uh, at their price point. So I've gone back and forth. Um, they didn't really want to do anything. And listen, I'm not here to, to throw Thursday bus or <laughs> to throw Thursday boots under the bus. Boy, Fro Freudian slip there. Um, however, the reason I wanted to make this follow-up is I, I really sang their praises last year uh, with the original Scout and did a nice video with these guys um, early on when I first got them. And I was really excited about these in the cinnamon suede. Um, but they've turned out to be, uh, let's say, less than stellar. Um, you know, I think you're buying boots at a price point and you get what you get. Um, what really turned me off and what really bothered me with this whole thing was the fact that, um, one, they didn't really want to do anything for me. And I don't mean like I'm looking for another free pair, just like, hey, give me a solution for the problem. Um, they didn't really want to hear that. And then they went back on all that and basically blame me for the boots issue. So I just want to keep it real and upfront with my subscribers and people who watch these reviews that there's good and bad. Uh, and again, I wasn't paid for any of these 
reviews for them, um, so they don't really care. But I just want to let you guys know that, you know, be careful when you're purchasing Thursday boots. Um, because I think some, like I said, the original Scout that I had was great. This one, obviously, much less than Stellar. Um, so, anyway, just want to kind of do a quick update of what these have been like in the last since I bought them. Uh, if there's anything else you guys want to see, let me know. Um, and please, if you're new, hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button so we can continue to grow. Thanks, guys. See you soon.